Yeah, here you go. It's really just cool to see the progress of this thing already. I mean, to have it tore down uh, to a frame like this, with just a couple days ago, I was sitting on it in front, excited uh, to have the core bike. Is is giving me a little bit of hope that we might be able to do this in time. Snapping peas in the backyard. I've been a year now with my hands in the dirt. Blood on my fingers can't show it hurts, so we gon' see if next Sunday comes. Well, I ain't gonna make it to work. I think we're at uh, 11 days in counting to completion. So his shop has been crazy busy. So uh, the guy's been working nighttime uh, after hours on this bike. It's super important to get the parts off the paint and powder coat ASAP. We gotta have them out in the next two days uh, and ready. Otherwise, there's no way we're gonna get them painted and back here, put back on the bike in time to reach our goal. tell you there's not very many companies who would just on the drop of a hat say okay fine do what you need to do let's build this bike really rad for a veteran uh, it is actually harder for me to pick out what I want out of all their cool products than it was to get them to help us out on this project thanks Kiriakin from the beginning I've been wanting to figure out a way that a veteran could take their rank patches and put them on the bike to really make it theirs and uh, I think this Rush Moat 6 from 511 Tactical is going to be the perfect option because it's got the Velcro and everything on here already so they can put their rate patch right on there and rock it on their bike. It should be pretty cool.